And ladies and gentlemen, our last but not least guest and conference. He's the Belgrade Design Week director, and he's going to tell us which is the secret of this fantastic event. Please welcome Jovan Jelovac. <laughs> It's a huge audience, thank you. Um, you will see uh, behind me uh, a set of images that we prepared for this presentation, which is going to, to uh, cover my, my uh, talk about Belgrade Design Week, and that's gonna last about 20 minutes, 25 minutes. And then you will uh, see a movie that we made specially for Bilbao, so it's going to be a premiere, uh, to really bring you some kind into the atmosphere of, of one of the best uh, world design festivals. So to start, uh, so just that you know what's, what's happening in the background. Um, <clears throat> for starters, uh, thank you very much for uh, inviting me to this wonderful city. Um, we have uh, immediately got a new job uh, being, uh, being a kind of the World Design League, which is to invent uh, a new, you know, like the leading hotels of the world, something like that. So we have, to, uh, we have absolutely to create a new liaison, which is going to be something like the best kept design secrets of the world, which is definitely not a secret anymore, but, but uh, uh, like, like, like a serious statement, which, are, which, which could be cities like Bilbao, like Torino, like, uh, like Dusseldorf and even Belgrade, which you will see later on. Because everybody goes usually to the typical tourist destinations, which are like Barcelona, Rome, Venice, Berlin, but uh, really not everybody goes to uh, Bilbao. Uh, I have been to Spain so many times before, and I am, for example, now for the first time ever in Bilbao. And, uh, and I, I absolutely, I'm sure that the same thing is happening with you as well. Um, hands up, who has been, of all of you, who has been to Belgrade, for example? Is there anyone in the audience? Okay, two people. Uh, yeah, okay, so, so you see, this is, this is my point. Um, and uh, for me, coming from Belgrade and uh, from Serbia, it's an immense privilege to actually do a bit of development help for Bilbao, <laughs> which, is, uh, which is the city that actually put city branding and place branding in a fantastic, honorable way uh, back on the, on the map of Earth. So I really want to thank you uh, Bilbao for that one as well. Um, I was asked to deliver a speech on the future of design by, by Gishon, and uh, as I believe in, in sharing uh, the best professional knowledge that one knows, I have decided uh, that my contribution into explaining what the future of design might be is actually to explain everything, and we called it the secret, of Belgrade Design Week, and not that it wouldn't be my job really to tell you about, uh, you know, philosophical uh, standpoints of the future of design, especially after spectacular speakers uh, that we heard here earlier, like uh, Alvin, like Shikomori. Uh, it, was, it, was, it was an amazing uh, insight what is actually being defined as the future of design. Uh, uh, by the way, <clears throat> I'm closing the conference, so I understand it that it's very good to have uh, Toshiko Mori and Alvin as, and Philip Stark even as warm up. Thank you very much, Gishon, and everybody. Uh, you know, you guys know how to create the climax of a conference. The best thing happened at the end. Um, that's a very good. That's a very good uh, conference design. <laughs> and having this important task to close the entire conference, my daughter is going to do it for me as well. Um, I have decided that the best thing is actually to transport you to another world, to the world of Belgrade Design Week, which is why I'm showing you all these images that we shot originally from all our superstar guests in the last six years, together with their quotes. It is a loop, so maybe you will try to understand and catch some of the expressions with your eyes as well. I hope my guys in the office didn't put any, you know, like uh, holiday photos or something inside of it, which is very often what they do to me when I go around. Um, because, as I have written to, to Gishon in the, in the papers uh, that we exchanged before the conference, uh, when they asked me what is the future of design, I believe that the future of design is in audiences who applaud design strongest. Because this is the very new point, the very new definition of design. The new superstars of design and the new future of design today are the new media, is the new internet about design, our websites like design.com, like designboom, stuff like that, 
and the conferences. These are actually, the, the, they're almost person uh, uh, already, and uh, the designers and all the creative people who make them happen, they come and go, but you get anchors, you get serious, like serious keystones in the world of design with all this media. So everybody says that our Belgrade Design Week that you see here in the back is a very special place on earth. Uh, media, lecturers, curators. <clears throat> so so what, what is really so special about it that we can help Bilbao uh, uh, build on and improve? I would like uh, a first movie to show you, which has nothing to do with Belgrade Design Week, but it's a very important, uh, it's a very important uh, uh, illustration. The Canal Plus movie, please. <laughs> of course, this movie has nothing to do with Belgrade Design Week, but it shows you the most important aspect of every event and of every experience. It's a good story. That is the most important thing. And also, audiences like to watch movies. That's why, uh, that's why I let you see this. Uh, so, uh, this is the first aspect of creating a conference that I would like to alert you to, creating a good old-fashioned story behind it, a real climax, something that is happening with the start, the middle, at the end. And also the second motion that I would like to alert you to is where you do it. And uh, uh, in the case of Belgrade Design Week, we do one of the world's best conferences in Serbia, of all places. So just to give you a small illustration of what that means, I will let you see another movie. Please, the, the YouTube. <laughs> this, my friends, is Serbia today. A battered country, stupidified by 20 years of dramatic developments that you've all seen on TV. And uh, uh, these are actually members of the Nationalist Party, which came for the first time ever in their life to Belgrade to have their political protests. And the first time ever that they saw actually uh, ele elevators, you know, uh, and they didn't know how to use it, they tried to go up. This is the countries where we are doing Belgrade Design Week. And this also explains the major reason why we as, a, as an NGO, as, as a private group of people, uh, we have create why we have created the design week. We have done this to enable the society of 